I want to swap the two numbers. Swap two numbers. And that is without using third variable. Without using third variable. And without using arithmetic operators like plus and minus. So how we can do this? Very simple. You can do this particular, you can achieve this particular program output using the bitwise operator. So let me give you the hint how we can do this. For example, I have a is equal to that is 20 and B is equal to that is 30. Now I want to swap the content that is I want A equal to 30 and B equal to 20 right. So that is very simple rule you can achieve this particular program output that is swap two numbers without using third variable and without using arithmetic operator you can use the operator that is bitwise exclusive or. So how we can do this let me give you the calculation first. So first you can take that is A is equal to A exclusive or B. So how we can calculate this? I need a binary of 20. So how we can calculate the binary of 20? Very simple. 1, 2, 4, 8 and 16. So binary of 20 is here 16 1, 16 plus 8 it will be 24, so it will be 0, 16 plus 4 it will be 20, so here 0, 0. So you can say binary of 20 is 1, 0, 1, double, 0. Now I want the binary of 30. So if you want the binary of 30, then you can say 1, that is 16, plus 8, it will be 24, plus 4, 28, plus 2, 30. So this is the binary of 30. So you can say this is the binary of 20 and this is the binary of 30. Now I want A equal to A exclusive or B. So what is the output of exclusive or? If both bit are different then the value will be 1. If both bit are different then the value will be 1. Else the value will be 0. So here the result is 10, 10 and you know 10, 10 means that is 1, 2, 4, 8, 8 plus 2, it will be 10. So now whenever you write A equal to A exclusive or B, then A value will be 10. Now you can write the second statement that is B equal to A exclusive or B. Now what is the value of A? A equal to A exclusive or B. So A will be 10. Now I want a B equal to A exclusive or B. So what is the value of B? B is 30. So here you can write the value 30. That is 1, 1, 1, 1 and 0. So now exclusive or of this. So if you write exclusive or of this, then 0, 1, it will be 1. 0, 1, it will be 1. Here 1, 1, it will be 0, 1, 1, it will be 0, 0, 0, it will be 0. Now you can just calculate this 1, 2, 4, 8 and 16. 1, 2, 4, 8 and 16. So 16 plus 4, it will be 20. So B is equal to A exclusive or B and you will get the value that will be 20. So your B will be assigned with the 20. So it means that the content of A is already there in the B. Now you can write the last instruction A equal to A exclusive or B. So now what is the value of A? The value of A is 10. What is the value of B? Value of B is this. So value of A is 10. So you can write here 0, 1, 0, 1, 0. It will be 10. So this is the value of A. Now I want A exclusive or B and you will get the A. So if both bit are different, value is 1. 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 
if both bit are same value is 0 now you can calculate 1 2 2 plus 4 it will be 6 plus 8 it will be 14 plus 16 it will be 30 and this is what your a is so your a will get the value that is 30 and now you can check your a is 20 b is 30 both are swapped see here i just swapped the number a have now value that is 30 and b has the value that is 20 so this is just a paperwork now i want to develop the program to swap the two numbers without using the third variable and without using arithmetic operator in short i want to swap the two numbers using the bitwise operator right so how we can do this practically in java so it is very simple let me create the program so i'm just saving this program as swap number using bitwise dot java so this is my program to swap using bitwise this is the class that is a swap i'm just taking here two numbers and that is integer a is equal to 20 now i'm taking b is equal to 30 a equal to a exclusive or b b is equal to a exclusive or b a is equal to a exclusive or b now i'm just printing the content of that is a and b a and b before swapping the content was this so i'm just writing here before swapping and that is slash n now i'm just copying this and pasting over here you can say that is after swapping the content is this so you can just run this particular program you can write here java c swap number using bitwise dot java now you can run java swap so before swap it is 20 and 30 after swap it is 30 and 20 so that's it from my side if you like this video then please like share and subscribe to my channel thank you very much have a nice day